brazen break-in at a Durrell community. Crooks targeting car after car on the very same day. And residents say this is not the first time they've been hit. Local 10's Roy Ramos is live. He has more on this crime that was caught on camera. Roy? Christy, and they are just frustrated with all of this, especially when they say this is the second time this has happened in just a few weeks. They say more needs to be done to keep them safe and keep their property secure. Surveillance cameras capturing a thief lifting a car cover off this pricey Corvette. While he's unable to break into this vehicle, it's just one stop of a busy night of break-ins inside the Las Brisas at Doral community overnight. Residents say 15 vehicles burglarized, one car stolen. They were locked. They opened it. I don't know how they opened it, but I just uh, saw on YouTube that there's a way to open it really easy. Watch as he walks away with what appears to be a duffel bag filled with stolen items before making his way inside this blue truck, taking his time searching for whatever valuables he can find. When he's done, onto this silver SUV. Then he nonchalantly walks over to the white car right beside it. Juan Sabati told me the thief made his way inside of his wife's Toyota Corolla, and while he's still trying to figure out what was taken, he knows he had personal documents that are now gone. It bothers me and concerns me because I have children, he said. What if they're the next victim? And that feels uh, frustrating because, you know, this is my house. You know, I have all my stuff here. You know, Ricardo Lopez upset after learning this is now the second time the thieves have targeted the neighborhood in just weeks. While he's fortunate he didn't load his pricey bike in his truck last night, he and other residents say more needs to be done to keep their community safe. Yeah, we have security from 5 p.m. till 5 a.m., but uh, looks like it's not working. So we did reach out to Doral Police. They tell me they are aware of what is going on here. In fact, they are continuing to gather evidence like that surveillance video that you just saw. If you have any information you feel can help them, you are urged to contact Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers. That number, 305-471-TIPS. For now, in Doral, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News.